Guys, I'm really happy that you made it through all the unit operations that we've shown in this course. Probably you're wondering why didn't we saw all the reactors or why didn't we analyze all the columns. Well, this is a basic course, guys, so I just want to let you know a little bit of the unit operations. If you are willing to learn more, you can keep going with your training. There are plenty of courses which show you how to use specific uh, units. For instance, if you are interested in absorption or maybe cleaning of sour gases, you will be using several towers, columns, piping systems, valves, pressurization, etc. So this depends on what process you're going to model. So I'm not going to tell you everyone because I can't, it's plenty of material, you will get overwhelmed, but at least you learn about the basics and remember you can always get help. If you're interested in modeling maybe a furnace, go in Aspen Heises verifier where can you find it, check out the input, how can you model it, what do you need to know, etc. And then you can model it by yourself and who knows, maybe you model it correctly and if not, at least you are more, uh, let's say, near than previously. So, hopefully you keep with your training guys. We saw basic unit operations. Hopefully in the intermediate or advanced courses you get to know more. So, see you in the next video.